mention of snow possibly in the forecast. Let's <laughs> and, and can we can we narrow the scope of that? I don't mean in location, but should people be concerned? Is this an ice event or just so, some fun uh, snow? This it, it's going to happen on a Sunday, likely during the afternoon hours here, if we get this to occur. So, if is the operative. So word. the thing is, it's Sunday. Most are off. That's good news. Monday again off as well because of Martin Luther King Jr. holiday. Uh, so uh, we're going to go through this, kind of show what we're talking about here. But uh, it would be a weekend thing. Right now, though, nothing to worry about. Things are good. Things are quiet. It's 38 degrees outside with some light winds. We are talking about pretty quiet weather. A few clouds up top too. 42 Alabaster, 35 Talladega to and. 32 for you in Gadsden now with 39 up in Coleman. Jasper is at freezing with Tuscaloosa coming in at 36 degrees. So pretty quiet. So looking at today's weather, we're going to see a partly cloudy sky out there to mostly sunny this afternoon. Temperatures get to about 60 degrees. Normally we should be about 54 this time of year. So we've seen some clouds overnight. A few more clouds are moving through now. Weak front's actually going to slide through the area today. No rain with it, but what it'll do is help to bring temperatures down a little bit for the day tomorrow as well too. So that's kind of what we have going on here now. The weak little clipper system coming by here to the north. So the bulk of that stays away from us. High pressure kind of staying to our south as well. But our attention is drawn to the west coast. This is our next system. It's still not quite on shore yet, but it will be a little later today. Once that happens, the forecast models be able to get a lot more data from this because they'll be able to get weather balloon data, also airplane data from it as well too. So when that happens, the accuracy goes up with the forecast models. So that's what we'll be watching with that. So that's going to come through Saturday into Sunday. So it's going to start as rain and possibly switch over there as we get into Sunday to maybe a mix. So here's how it plays out before that. Today, again, kind of partly cloudy out there. Temperatures warming up to about 56 at lunchtime, around 60 this afternoon for much of the area with a mostly sunny sky. 50 by dinner time tonight and tomorrow morning we'll wake up to a maybe mostly clear start. Temperatures in the mid 30s and then we'll see some high clouds continue to come in during the day tomorrow. Temperatures about 55 degrees. Saturday morning starting dry there in the 40s and then during the day we'll start seeing a little rain moving in by one o'clock in the afternoon. Fairly dry still at that point, but it's during the afternoon is when we'll start to see that rain moving in with this next system, possibly changing to snow on Sunday. Still way too early to talk about any kind of possible snow totals as the system will move through surface low and an upper level low behind it. And as they move on through, here's what will happen here. So here comes that front during the day Saturday into Sunday morning. That low will move off to the east of us, but it's the back side of it wrap around here. That's where the potential from lunchtime to the afternoon for maybe seeing some snow roughly from the Birmingham area I-20 northward, the best chance of seeing some of that. The accumulations probably if we get any light on grassy surfaces and elevated surfaces, but definitely something we'll be keeping an eye on as we go throughout the day on Sunday <clears throat> as we head into Sunday afternoon into the evening hours. So there's that potential rain to snow and it will be a cold day with temperatures there into the 40s through Monday.